four mil or a hair clip? Come on, who in their right mind would choose the achoo? No. At least it's kind of cute. I can't come to your party. But you promised. I know, I'm so sorry. <sighs> come on, girl, you're like the mutual friend. If you don't come, then no one else is gonna wanna come. Look, my parents said no. She doesn't wanna come to your party because she doesn't like you. You sure that's the reason? Yes, I wouldn't lie, okay? Goodbye. Mom says you have to take me to the mall. She's lying. Your mom just grounded her. Mom just grounded you? How did you know that? You weren't even home when it happened. I don't know. I just did, okay? Now get out. Oh, whatever. Does this hair clip tell me the truth about people? Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry babe, I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. If he doesn't work for Walmart, then where does he... I'm following him. What is he doing here? This place looks super sketchy. What do you think you're doing, huh? Come here. Hey, boss, look who I found snooping around here. Babe, what, what is going on? Babe, you know this girl? I've never seen her before in my life. I'm sorry, did our two years together just mean nothing to you? Two years? Have you been keeping secrets from me? I told you, you know what the rules are. He's trying to protect you by lying. He works for very dangerous men. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. He's lying to protect you. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. <laughs> you see, sir, I would kill her, but you know, I don't want to mess up this new shirt, so- Either you kill her, or him and I will do it ourselves. No, please. Look, let's just all settle down. You just- I think I'm gonna need a change of clothes. Really, babe? The Mafia? You're lucky I find that kind of attractive. Well, I know a place we can lay low. I bet. But we gotta be careful who we trust. I have something that can help with that. Please be more than 50 this time. 100! Oh, no, sweetheart, that says 10. What are we gonna do? I don't know. Every day she barely gets any brain cells. Hey, don't eat that. I won't have a delinquent for a daughter. Hey, your squishy panda isn't food. You know what? I know what we need to do. You're telling me there's a special smart candy that can boost her brain cells? Yes, but they haven't been tested much. I'm a walrus. Give me those. We're trying them. Open wide, sweetheart. Now chew. Oh my gosh, it's working. Let's test her brain cells. Spell onomatopoeia. Onomatopoeia. O-N-O-M-A-T-O-P-O-E-I-A. Yes, she's smart now. We'll give her the candy every day. She actually got a decent amount of brain cells. Guess she doesn't need the candy today. But she's been taking it every day for years. Let me see the candy. She'll be fine. Yeah, there shouldn't be any side effects. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. Now, my opponent has pointed out some of the positives of AI, but I would like to point out some of the negatives. Which are, um... Sorry, I can't remember what I was going to say. Yo, is she okay? What the heck is going on? Maybe she got stage fright. You guys, look, she's losing brain cells. Dude, that's not supposed to happen. Hey, girly, are you okay? Maybe we should get you some help. Zapotha. Oh, no. Bro, she's, like, super dumb now. Today was her big debate. I have to tell her parents. Huh? Come on, you're coming with me. So there was side effects to that smart candy. I guess so. She keeps losing brain cells. I don't know if the candy's gonna work anymore. She's gonna be brain dead without it. Let's just try. Sweetie, open up. Mm -mm. Open up or I'll do it for you. Come on. Good girl. It's kind of working. No, she needs more candy. It's supposed to be one a day. She needs more brain cells. Here, have some more. And a little bit more. Honey, this is a bad idea. She, she has, has infinite, infinite brain, brain cells. cells. Yes, unfortunately, my intelligence level has now surpassed your small, feeble minds. Honey, she's scaring me. We should take her to get checked out. I think I gave her too much. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Why not? 
Because my mind is telling me that if you do that, that will be the end of both of you. What? Oh, honey. You're up early. Good morning, mother. Good morning, father. We see you still have infinite brain cells. <laughs> When is this smart candy going to wear off? My mind is telling me that the effects from this candy won't be wearing off until around two weeks from now. No, honey, we really need to take you to get checked. I already told you that that is a bad idea. You're not the boss. You may think you know everything, but you don't. I know what you were doing on Instagram last night. Huh? What is she talking about, honey? Uh... Nothing. It's just, um, does the name Sandy Smith ring a bell? How do you know? <gasps> Your ex from high school? Are you still liking her posts? Just two of them. What? So what I can gather from dad's body language is that he does love you more than Sandy, but if he doesn't block her within the next two hours, it will lead to a divorce for both of you. Darren? I'm doing it. Uh, she's blocked. <laughs> My sources say that uh, you made the right call. I want her to go back to normal. Same, but as long as she's like this, we might as well make some money off of her. So, how does a game show sound? I would win all the money. Really? really? But I don't wish to do that at this time. Say what? Why not? <sighs> Reasons you can't understand. <laughs> Because you're stupid. <laughs> That's it. We have to turn her back to normal. Yeah, and I think I know how. Surprise! We got you something. Gummy bears? They're your favorite, right? So go on, have a bite. Did you know that the gummy bear was invented in 1922 in Germany? Wow, thanks for the interesting fact. Now try it. You two are trying to poison me. What? We would never. Well, then you eat it first. Oh, she got me right in the eye. <gasps> oh, honey. That's it. Grab her arms. What? Grab her. No. Sweetie, just hold still. Uh -oh. Ow! Just eat the gummy and this will all be over. Yes, there you go. I thought these gummies were supposed to turn her back to normal. They were. She's brain dead. No, honey, please wake up. Oh, no. What the? Oh, my gosh, it worked. What just happened? Wow. Uh, I feel really weird. Honey, we're so glad you're back to normal. Back to normal? You're telling me there's a special smart candy that can boost her brain cells? Here, have some more. And a little bit more. Honey, this is a bad idea. I remember what you guys did to me. We're so sorry. It won't happen again. Maybe you two should eat some of those smart candies so you could figure out how to do proper parenting. Oh, that's, that's not, not a bad, bad idea. idea. Wait. Give me those. You two are banned from these. But... I'm just Ken, and you were a else I'd be a 10. Mommy, what's that? It's like charades, honey. You just have to act out your word very quickly, and I have to guess. Okay, you ready? <laughs> oh, a, a dog. <sighs> Understand how to play? Yeah. I got a word now. What am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You use your feet. A motorcycle? No, honey, please hurry or something bad is going to happen to mommy. I don't know. I don't I know. I bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm safe. I don't like this game. A camera? No, and the time's up. Yes. No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I got a word. Rawr. Okay, um, a lion? No. <laughs> A tiger? A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie, you only have 10 seconds left. Rawr. A cheetah? A leopard? A... Just tell me what it is. Whisper the word. Okay, uh, it's a panther. A panther! Yay, you got it right. I'm safe. Yeah. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Officer? Hello, ma'am. We're looking for a girl named Susie. We believe your daughter cheated. Tell me what it is. Whisper the word. Okay, uh, it's a panther. A panther! <laughs> Susie, did you cheat? No, my sister guessed the right answer. Uh-huh. Well, the report could have been a glitch. Remember, cheating has consequences. We know. Have a nice day. What was that about? Look, Mom, let's just say that Susie is not good at this game. We need to sign her up for acting classes or something. Honey, don't tell me you actually cheated. I wasn't gonna let her die. Huh? Let who die? No one. Nothing, Susie. We're just talking, sweetheart. You are lucky you got off the hook this time. Mom? No, this is ridiculous. Mom, I have a word. Okay, go ahead. You're holding your breath. You're swimming. You're you're a shark? No. Uh the Water Olympics? No, mom, come on. Let me guess, let me guess. Um um scuba diver. Yes. <sighs> That was a close one. Uh oh, I got a word. Come on, Susie, you got this. Ooh, I learned about this in school. Okay, honey, act it out. It looks like she's swimming. Um a duck? No, not that. A swan? Nope. Grr. Um What is it? I don't know. Okay, Mom, I don't know. Just help her. Splash. We have to cheat again. No, don't. Mom. Susie, what is your word? My word is... Susie? She's alive. That was scary. 
I really thought we lost her. This doesn't make any sense. Every time someone gets a word wrong, an armed drone comes down and shoots them. I know, honey, but the drone missed. No, but the drones never miss. The creator of the game programmed them to have perfect accuracy. There's something you need to know. Your father is the creator of this game. What? It's the reason I divorced him. You mean to tell me that our father is the reason for this game existing? Yes. I'm going to act it out headquarters, and I'm getting Dad to shut down this game. No, it's too dangerous. He didn't kill Susie, which means he still cares about us. I have to try. Hey, you're not allowed to be in yet. My father is Darren White, the creator of this game, and I want to speak to him. Oh, really? You got some ID on you? Oh. Now let me see my father. I see your mom finally told you about me. You've got a lot of explaining to do. You got a word, didn't you? Don't worry, I'll guess it for you. Act it out. No. What? Me and everyone else are done playing this game. Sweetheart, you're gonna run out of time. End the game. Just act it out. I can't. No, if you really love me, you're gonna end it right now. I've put too much work into this game to stop it now. Then I guess you're only gonna have one daughter. No, honey. Oh my god, what have I done? Dad. Shut the game down. But sir, I said shut it down. The game is offline. Good. I gotta get her to a hospital. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I can't believe this happened. I did it for all of us. So daddy's gone? Yeah, the doctor said once he found out she was okay, he took off. All that matters is that this horrible game is over. Yeah. Sissy needs to rest now. I'm so proud of you, sweetheart. Thanks, Mom. Mom, look, I can get a teddy bear or a paintbrush. I think I'm gonna go with teddy bear. <gasps> no, pick the paintbrush. But I said pick it. Okay. My paintbrush came in. Oh, thank goodness. There, that's for you. Now paint money. Money? Why money? Honey, just paint it. Okay. Okay, I'm done, but I don't understand why- Shh! Look! Your paintbrush is magic. No way. So you're telling me that everything I paint will come to life? Yes, the paintbrush only works for you. Well, I want to paint a puppy. Honey, no. Don't be selfish. You need to think of others before yourself, and there's lots of things that I need. Okay, here's your gold crown. Oh, it's perfect. Mom, can you please make me some food? All this painting is making me really hungry. Why, of course. But don't draw anything while I'm cooking. I'm gonna paint something she would never let me have. My own boyfriend. Honey, dinners. Let me see that. What did you paint? Nothing. I was just scribbling. Really? Then let me see it. No, wait. What is this? This is going in the garbage. Please, he wasn't done yet. He? Were you trying to draw a boyfriend? No. Give me that. No, this is my magic paintbrush. You can't just- Don't tell me what I can't do. I'm confiscating all of your paint stuff until tomorrow. Sorry, Mom, but I'm finishing this. The last thing I need is his eye color. I think this blue will look nice. He's done. Did you learn your lesson? Yeah, I did. Good. Here's your painting supplies back. Today, there is a lot I need you to paint for me. I finished your purple hair clips. Thank you, honey. Can I be done now? Hmm. I know you're not that tired. Well, it has been two hours, so okay, you rest. Mom, five more minutes. I'm not your mom. I'm your boyfriend. I'm your boyfriend. You look exactly like how I pictured you. Down to the hair color and everything. I can't believe this. I didn't even do the best job painting you, but you seem to have come out. Who is this? That's the delivery man. Delivery man? I didn't order anything. Excuse me, I'm her boyfriend. What? You disobeyed me. Mom, I have been painting so much stuff for you, and all I ask for is just one boyfriend, please. Do you have my hair clips? Yeah, they're right here. What are you doing? Testing a theory. If I rip his painting, he disappears. Look, I found it. Stop! Mom, let go, please, you're hurting him. Oh, that's the point. No! It's okay. Hey, catch! Don't give that to her! What are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Getting you out of my life. You can't do that- Where did she go? I, uh, painted her on a tropical island, but don't worry. I'll make sure she's well taken care of. <gasps> 10,000? But Mommy and Daddy always give me 15,000. They must be trying to put me on a budget or something. My parents only gave me $5 today. Yikes, sucks for you. Please, can you buy me my lunch? No, I don't think I will. Oh, please, I'm so hungry. Sorry, I can't help you. You know what? You're gonna regret this.
Okay, your total's 8,000. Oh, I don't quite have enough. <laughs> Do you want me to just put it on hold for you? No, I really wanted to get this bag today. Um, my parents are gonna reload my balance tomorrow. Is it okay if I just pay for it then? Yeah, sure, we can do that for you, babe. Mm. Thank you. Five dollars? No, this this has to be an error or something. If you don't have the money, you have to return the bag. Well, about that, I kind of sort of already gave it away as a birthday present. Okay, then you're getting arrested. Security? Wait, what? Officer, there's been a mistake. I have a lot of money. Yeah, sure. Just sign right here, okay? I am not signing anything until I speak to my lawyer. Oh, really? Yes, and I know that I get one phone call. What, you gonna call mommy and daddy to come save you? Maybe. You're something else, kid. Come on, follow me. <sighs> Hello? Mommy, it's me. Make it quick, darling. I'm at a photo shoot. Mommy, I've been arrested. What? Yes, why did you and Daddy only give me $5 today? $5? No, Daddy and I sent you 15 k What? Then I don't know what happened, but can you guys come get me? I'm in France right now, darling. Okay, then what about Daddy? Daddy is shooting a movie in Dubai. Well, then what am I supposed to do? Joanna, we need you. Darling, I'll call you back. Hello? Hey, you got a visitor. Mommy and Daddy finally came to get me. Hi, remember me? I told you you'd regret not buying me that lunch. You switched our bank accounts, didn't you? Mm-hmm. I learned how to hack the system. It's something I've been working on for a very long time. All of this because I wouldn't buy you a stupid lunch? Not just that. You're a spoiled little brat who needed to be taught a lesson. You don't know me. Oh, but I do. I did my research on you. Your mommy is a model and your daddy is a movie star. But they both love their careers more than you. That isn't true. Oh, really? Then why aren't they here? Give me back my money. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, thanks? <laughs> Just kidding. <gasps> hey, you little- Watch it. If you want to get out of here, you're going to do exactly as I say. Now that you're out, for every task you do for me, I'll give you back five dollars. But that'll take forever. Exactly. Go clean my bathroom. Yeah, no way. All right, then. I guess I'm never switching our bank accounts back. Okay, fine. That's what I thought. Now get to scrubbing. Okay, I'm all done. Good, here you go. It's kind of hot in here, so fan me with this. Who do you think you are, royalty or something? <laughs> Might as well be. Now do it. Can I stop now? Hey, what was that about? No complaining or you lose money. All right, you know what? That's it. Ugh. No, stop! <laughs> Darling, I'm so proud of you for getting your money back. Yeah, but I realize I should be a little bit more generous with my money, since you guys do give me so much. Darling, your daddy's movie got cancelled, so we're gonna have to cut back. Oh, well then, um, how much am I gonna get now? Well, you see... So, how many words you get? Three again? Well, you might as well use them up right now. I love you. Aw, oh, babe, I love you even more. And what can I get you to? I'll take the steak and fries, and she's going to get the side salad. That's it? Are you sure you don't want a bit more to eat? She doesn't have any more words left. Oh, I apologize. I didn't realize. Let me see that one, babe. Nah, I don't like it. I'm going to find you something else. Here, try this one on. I'll come with you. Excuse me, sir, but there's only one person allowed in the fitting room at a time. What? But she needs help putting this on. Oh, well, since I work here, I can go ahead and help her out with that. It's no problem. Fine. Just don't be too long. Is everything okay? Oh, you don't have any words left, do you? I'm really not supposed to do this, but here. Hopefully that's enough words for you. He's not my boyfriend. Babe, you almost done? Sorry, her zipper got stuck. She'll be right out. Okay, just pretend everything's fine, and I'm gonna go get my manager. No, please don't. You'll get... I'm coming in! Whoa, hey, look at you. Red is definitely your color. We'll take it. Okay, I'll go ring you guys up in the front. All right, you're all set, and here's a gift receipt, just in case you need it. Thanks. Come on, let's go. Glad they let you wear that out, huh? Hope you're hungry, because I'm making us some food. Babe, I made us a special dinner because you look so beautiful. Here, try some. Baby, come on. I promise it won't make you tired like last time. Somebody's feisty tonight. You know, why did that lady give you a gift receipt? It's not like you're going to return it. What does it even say on here? 
No! Where did you get words from? Who gave you those words? Was it the saleswoman? Why did she do that? All out of words again, huh? How convenient. No, I want an answer. Wait here. Okay, now write down why she gave you those words. Let me see that. You better have a good answer. You don't know? So what? She was just being nice? Well, if I find out that you're lying, you know what happens. Hey, I'm back. So you like the food? Good, good. Babe, can you hear me? Yeah, she's out. Sorry, but I had a feeling you were going to try and leave tonight. What the hell are you doing? You didn't actually eat the dinner, did you? Well, aren't you quite the little actress, pretending to be asleep like that? Now, what were you doing with my Amber Alert? Missing girl from 2018 shit. So why didn't you call the police right away? I was too scared to call the police at the time, but after they left, I did, and that's when they told me her description matched Claire Montgomery, who's the girl who went missing in 2018. After all I've done for you, and you go and lie to me, I need to ask you a question, and I don't want to set you free, so... How did you? Haven't you figured it out by now? I found a way to steal your words, and I can control how many you get. I mean, I gotta admit, it's pretty adorable watching you anxiously wait every year, hoping you'll get more words. But how many do you always end up getting? Three. And what do I ask you to tell me every year? I love you. I love you. Those were the only words I wanted to hear from you for so long. But you were never into me. Because you were a stalker. I admired you, Claire. I... I care about you a lot. Then let me go. You know I can't do that. I have to protect you. You're insane. And you're using up all your words. Here, take some more. You are a sick son of a... On second thought, maybe it's best if you remain silent. This is why I could never give you any more words. I'll come back down here once you... Looks like we got company. Officer, I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. That may be the case, but we're going to take a look around, and if we don't find anything, then you'll be good to go. So far, I don't see anybody here, sir. Keep looking. Want to get your words back? 10, 10 9, 9, 8, 8 4, 4, 3, 3 2, 2, 1. 1. Words retrieved. Since we can't find anyone, we're going to... No. No, help, I'm down here. Wait, where's that coming from? He has a basement. I'm I'm in the basement. Show us where she is right now. Whoa, okay, okay. Hey, are you Claire Montgomery? Yes, yes, that's me. Oh my god. Okay, don't worry. Everything's gonna be okay. How did you get your words back? Boys, get him out of here. Don't even look at him. It's all right. Claire, tell him you love me. Tell him that I was good to you. Tell him or else I'll... Stop it. Somebody get him in the car. Want to take Derek's words? Babe, please! Get in the car, Miss the Paca. Babe, you have to listen to- Don't call me babe. In fact, you're not going to be able to call me anything now. You're finally going to get to feel how I felt for these past three years. Being silenced isn't very fun, is it, Derek? Looks like Miss the Paca got what he deserved. Come on, give me an X. Oh, no, no, no. I cannot be a hider. My whole family are seekers. Concealer, please don't fail me now. Okay, let's see your mark. <gasps> yes, I knew Our it. Our girl is a seeker. Now we can finally tell you how the game works. So, of course, there's hiders and there's seekers, but everyone wants to be a seeker. The hiders are given a certain amount of time to hide, and then we get to go find them. When you find the hiders, do you... No, honey. <sighs> okay. We knock them out, and then we trade them in for money. What? If you turn in a family member that's a hider, you get a million. Well, I mean, that's kind of stupid because family members, they are worth a lot more than money, right? I'd turn your butt in in five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Honey. What? You're sweating. No. You okay? Um, no, I actually think that I might be bleeding, so I'm going to go wash my face. I'll be right back. Oh, shit. I knew it. The makeup came off. What the? Ellie. No. You're a hider. I can explain. You little liar. I'm telling mom and dad. 
Kim's a hider. What? What? She faked your mark. I'm sorry. Why would you do that? Because I, I was scared. Attention, the game has begun. All hiders now have two hours to find a hiding spot. Go hide. No. You have to. Just don't let us find you. But hide now, damn it. Get out of here. This is my spot. I don't know where to hide. All the flights are booked and all the buses are filled. What am I going to do? <coughs> Shh. Listen, you're about to get caught. Hey, I said you're about to get caught. Come on, let's go. You're a seeker. You're trying to trick me. This mark is fake. If I were a real seeker, you'd be knocked out by now. Just play along. What? Shh, don't say anything. Well, well, what do we have here? You caught a hider, huh? Yeah, she was a hard one to find, but I finally caught her. We were just leaving, actually. Nah, she's not going anywhere. Don't touch her! Um, are hiders allowed to fight back? No, not really. Run! Oh, shit. Quick, in there! Whoa, wait, what is that? An underground tunnel I made. Now come on! I am not going down there. I don't even know if I can really trust you. I've gotten you this far, haven't I? We have to go now. We'll be safe down here. Why are you helping me? Because you... Who gave you that necklace? My sister. Get rid of that necklace. Your sister is tracking you. No, she... she wouldn't. Oh, yes, she would. We need to keep moving. No. Excuse me? Yeah, I want to know why you came out of nowhere like like some ninja and saved me, but you don't even know me. It's because you remind me of my sister who got traded in by my family. They traded in your sister for a million dollars? Yeah, and from then on, I've been trying to protect all the hiders I can. <sighs> what was that? They found my tunnel. I'll distract them, you run. No, I'm not gonna leave you. Yes, you are. I'm not losing another girl on my watch. Now go! <laughs> Ellie, found you. You're it. Oh. Sorry, sis. That necklace led me right to you. Time to get my million. Nighty night, Kim. Time to get my money. Where am I? And what am I wearing? We're in Hyder Prison, and that's our uniform. They think we're related. Really? I mean, we do kind of look alike, I guess. You remind me of my sister, who got traded in by my family. Do you have a brother that's a hider? Yeah, why? Because I think I know him. He tried to save me, but my sister turned me in. He is so worried about you. There has to be some way out of here. After you get caught, you have the option to end the game, but if you do, you die. Someone has to sacrifice themselves to save everyone else. That's why no one ends the game. I'll do it. My whole family turned against me, so I really have nothing, and you deserve to be with your brother. No. Want to end the game? It'll be okay. No, please. Congratulations, your bravery has made you leader. Our marks are gone. You pick the next game. Okay, what'd you get? <gasps> A mermaid. What? I mean, that would explain the pink in her hair. Honey, she's lying. No, it really says that. Shh, that is enough of your nonsense. Hi, pretend mermaid. We know that's not your hair. It is. Okay, let's see. Ow! You probably glued it. Don't lie about your future. I'm not. It really does say that. Mermaids don't exist. Stop trying to get attention. Hey, how was your day? Horrible. No one believes me. <sighs> Honey, there's something I need to tell you. What are you talking about? Your mom and I aren't your real parents. What? We found you as a baby by the beach, and that was in your hands. So, let me get this straight. You found me on the beach as a baby, holding this necklace? Yeah, honey, I know this is a lot to take in. Well, I mean, didn't you look for my parents? They, they could have been around somewhere. We did. We were the only ones at that beach. It was a private beach. But you know, I really do believe your future. And I think your real parents are still out there. Do you really think so? Yeah, I do. I think you should wear the necklace. What is going on? Dad told me the truth about everything. What? We agreed to wait until she was 18. <laughs> no, look, I know now that my future is true, and I think this might be the key to me finding my real parents. Give me that. No more nonsense. But that's mine. As your mother, it belongs to me. He told her everything. 
I know her transformation is coming. That's why I need you to get over here to help me with her. Get in the car, we're leaving. Wait, what? Hello, nice to meet you, Morlina. What is going on? What is this place? This is my laboratory. I study your kind. My kind? Yes, mermaids, of course. But I thought mermaids didn't exist. Right, Mom? I actually believe your future, honey. You made me feel like I was crazy. I was just trying to protect you. No, I want to go home. But Merlina, look what I have. We just want to help you transform. And you can find your real parents. Do you promise? Yes. We just want to help. So what do you need me to do? Okay, now repeat after me. I wish I was a mermaid. I wish I was a mermaid. It's working. The necklace is magic. Her future is changing. Oh no, you can't breathe? <gasps> you were right, she is the princess. I can't believe she's a princess. This is amazing. Mom, you're awake. How do you know my future? Shh, just rest. I don't feel good. I know, honey. It's because you're still in your mermaid form. It's okay, we got you a tank. Tank? Yes, but in the meantime, we have you hooked up to two IV machines. We just need a few more blood samples. Can you believe mermaids have blue blood? Honey, can you hear me? Dad? Yeah, it's gonna be okay. This has gotta come off. Hey, you feel better, right? Yes, how did you know that would turn me back human? Because your real mother had one just like it. You see, one day I was out fishing, and I noticed a woman asking for help on the shore. She was a mermaid, and after I saved her, we fell in love. She got this magic necklace from her father that she said helped her stay human. But the day I proposed, she left me. Why? Wait, so does that mean you're my real dad? Yeah, I think I am. For many years, I didn't believe it. Because when Sylvia left me, she didn't say why. She was a queen. Wait, what? Why do you say that? My future, it changed a princess after I put on that necklace. Oh my gosh, so your mom was a queen. She must have left me to go back to her people. But I don't understand. If mom left you, then how was I born? Well, I realized something. I think your mom was pregnant when she left me. Because nine months later, I found this on the beach. This was me? <laughs> yep. I think your mom left you there for me so you could have a normal life. But that really wasn't the case. As soon as you learned how to crawl, all you wanted to do was go in the water. You loved anything that had to do with the ocean. And my new wife started to catch on. That's not normal. Where did she get that pink streak? She became obsessed with researching things about you, but she never wanted you to know. That's right, I didn't. I'm not letting you ruin my research. You have water powers. Use them. What are you doing? Making sure you don't bother me ever again. <laughs> Merlina, that was amazing. Red alert. We have to go. Come on. All right, you got the necklace on. Now wish to be a mermaid. But dad. I'm sorry, but that scientist told too many people about you. You're not safe here anymore. You belong under the sea with your real mom. That's the police. You gotta make the wish now. When you find your mom, tell her I love her. I will never forget you. I'll find a way to see you again. I love you. I wish to be a mermaid. <gasps> mom? No, it can't be. Darling? It's you, my baby. I knew you'd find me. My lost daughter has returned. This has been waiting for you. You are now Princess Merlina. All hail your new mermaid princess. So, how many words you get? Three again? Well, you might as well use them up right now. I love you. Aw, oh, babe. I love you even more. And what can I get you two? I'll take the steak and fries, and she's going to get the side salad. That's it? Are you sure you don't want a bit more to eat? She doesn't have any more words left. Oh, I apologize. I didn't realize. Let me see that one, babe. Nah, I don't like it. I'm going to find you something else. Here, try this one on. I'll come with you. Excuse me, sir, but there's only one person allowed in the fitting room at a time. What? But she needs help putting this on. Oh, well, since I work here, I can go ahead and help her out with that. It's no problem. Fine. Just don't be too long. Is everything okay? Oh, you don't have any words left, do you? I'm really not supposed to do this, but here. Hopefully that's enough words for you. He's not my boyfriend. 
Babe, you almost done? Sorry, her zipper got stuck. She'll be right out. Okay, just pretend everything's fine, and I'm gonna go get my manager. No, please don't. You'll get... I'm coming in. Whoa, hey, look at you. Red is definitely your color. We'll take it. Okay, I'll go ring you guys up in the front. All right, you're all set, and here's a gift receipt just in case you need it. Thanks. Come on, let's go. Glad they let you wear that out, huh? Hope you're hungry, because I'm making us some food. Babe, I made us a special dinner because you look so beautiful. Here, try some. Baby, come on, I promise it won't make you tired like last time. Somebody's feisty tonight. You know, why did that lady give you a gift receipt? It's not like you're going to return it. What does it even say on here? No! Where did you get words from? Who gave you those words? Was it the saleswoman? Why did she do that? All out of words again, huh? How convenient. No, I want an answer. Wait here. Okay, now write down why she gave you those words. Let me see that. You better have a good answer. You don't know? So what? She was just being nice? Well, if I find out that you're lying, you know what happens. Hey, I'm back. So you like the food? Good, good. Babe, can you hear me? Yeah, she's out. Sorry, but I had a feeling you were going to try and leave tonight. What the hell are you doing? You didn't actually eat the dinner, did you? Well, aren't you quite the little actress, pretending to be asleep like that? Now, what were you doing with my... Amber Alert, missing girl from 2018 shit. So why didn't you call the police right away? I was too scared to call the police at the time, but after they left, I did, and that's when they told me her description matched Claire Montgomery, who's the girl who went missing in 2018. After all I've done for you, and you go and lie to me, I need to ask you a question, and I don't want to set you free, so... How did you... Haven't you figured it out by now? I found a way to steal your words, and I can control how many you get. I mean, I gotta admit, it's pretty adorable watching you anxiously wait every year, hoping you'll get more words. But how many do you always end up getting? Three. And what do I ask you to tell me every year? I love you. I love you. Those were the only words I wanted to hear from you for so long. But you were never into me. Because you were a stalker. I admired you, Claire. I... I care about you a lot. Then let me go. You know I can't do that. I have to protect you. You're insane. And you're using up all your words. Here, take some more. You are a sick son of a... On second thought, maybe it's best if you remain silent. This is why I can never give you any more words. I'll come back down here once you... Looks like we got company. Officer, I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. That may be the case, but we're going to take a look around, and if we don't find anything, then you'll be good to go. So far, I don't see anybody here, sir. Keep looking. Want to get your words back? 10, 9, 8, 4, 3, 2, 1. Words retrieved. Since we can't find anyone, we're going to... No. No help, I'm down here. Wait, where's that coming from? He has a basement. I'm I'm in the basement. Show us where she is right now. Whoa, okay, okay. Hey, are you Claire Montgomery? Yes, yes, that's me. Oh my god. Okay, don't worry, everything's gonna be okay. How did you get your words back? Boys, get him out of here. Don't even look at him, it's alright. Claire, tell him you love me. Tell him that I was good to you. Tell him or else I'll stop it. Somebody get him in the car. Want to take Derek's words? Babe, please! Get in the car, Miss the Paca. Babe, you have to listen to- Don't call me babe. In fact, you're not going to be able to call me anything now. You're finally going to get to feel how I felt for these past three years. Being silenced isn't very fun, is it, Derek? Looks like Miss the Paca got what he deserved. So, how many words you get for the year? Only three again. Aw, oh, might as well use them up. Come on. I love you. And I love you more. Hi, huh, what can I get you today? She doesn't have any words, miss, but I'll order for her. She's just gonna have a salad, but I'm gonna get a cheeseburger, double fries. Babe, you're looking kind of pale today. You wanna get your makeup done? Yeah, you do. Come on, let's go. I love this color on you. Me too. Hey, babe, show her the bruise. 
Any chance you can cover that? She's so clumsy. Oh, yeah, totally. We can take care of that. Sir, would you want to buy the concealer I use on her? Actually, yeah, that'd be great. I'll go pay for this. You stay here. I love this. He can't hear us anymore. Here, take some words. Please, you can trust me. Is something wrong? He can't hear you right now. He's not my boyfriend. He's not, is he? I knew it. Okay, listen, I'm going to get help for you. But I'm gonna need you to give me some more information. He's coming. Okay, got the concealer. Time to go. Sir, wait. He's not my boyfriend. He's not, is he? I knew it. Okay, listen, I'm going to get help for you. But I'm gonna need you to give me some more information. He's coming. Okay, got the concealer. Time to go. Sir, wait. Why is the makeup lady chasing after us? Sir! Let's get out of here. Well, that was weird. Did she at least cover up your bruise? Good. Good. Go change your hair to a different style. I'm gonna go make dinner. You look much better now, babe. Breaking news as of today. What's going on? Let me turn this up. No, don't! Did you just... How the hell did you get words? So now you want to be quiet, huh? Answer me! How did you get them? You don't have any left now, do you? Give me that remote. You better hope this news isn't about you. So this girl comes into my makeup store with a bruise. I gave her some words and it turns out the man she was with... <laughs> you ratted me out? After everything that I've done for you. I have been so good to you. Now that's gonna change. Police, open the door. They finally found me. But they won't find you. Officer, I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. I'm the only one who lives here. Yeah, well, I've searched the whole place. I haven't seen anything. Right, the missing girl's obviously not here. It seems so, but you match the description of the kidnapper. There's definitely been a mistake. Down here! I'm down here! What was that? Wait a minute, don't- Oh my god. You found me. Ma'am, stay right there. Mr. Hart, you're under arrest. Thank you so much for finding me. He's had me here for two years. He's been controlling your words. What? Yes, ma'am. We found this illegal device on him that steals people's words. That would explain why every year I would only get three words. Go on. Say it. I love you. And he made me say I loved him. Hey, come here! Ugh. You don't deserve to sp- Ugh. Get back here! The only one that doesn't deserve to speak is you. That's right, and she's keeping your words permanently. Now you finally see what it feels like to not have a voice. It doesn't feel good, does it? Prison's gonna be real fun for him. Ugh. You're finally free now. Alright, Mr. Hart, let's go. Any last words before you go off to prison? Oh wait, you don't have any. <laughs> so, how many words you get? Three again? Well, you might as well use them up right now. I love you. Aw, oh, babe. I love you even more. And what can I get you to? I'll take the steak and fries and she's gonna get the side salad. That's it? Are you sure you don't want a bit more to eat? She doesn't have any more words left. Oh, I apologize. I didn't realize... Let me see that one, babe. Nah, I don't like it. I'm gonna find you something else. Here, try this one on. I'll come with you. Excuse me, sir, but there's only one person allowed in the fitting room at a time. What? But she needs help putting this on. Oh, well, since I work here, I can go ahead and help her out with that. It's no problem. Fine. Just don't be too long. Is everything okay? Oh, you don't have any words left, do you? I'm really not supposed to do this, but here... Hopefully that's enough words for you. He's not my boyfriend. Babe, you almost done? Sorry, her zipper got stuck. She'll be right out. Okay, just pretend everything's fine, and I'm gonna go get my manager. No, please don't. You'll get... I'm coming in. Whoa, hey, look at you. Red is definitely your color. We'll take it. Okay, I'll go ring you guys up in the front. All right, you're all set, and here's a gift receipt just in case you need it. Thanks. Come on, let's go. Glad they let you wear that out, huh? Hope you're hungry, because I'm making us some food. Babe, I made us a special dinner because you look so beautiful. Here, try some. Baby, come on, I promise it won't make you tired like last time. Somebody's feisty tonight. You know, why did that lady give you a gift receipt? It's not like you're going to return it. What does it even say on here? No! Where did you get words from? Who gave you those words? Was it the saleswoman? Why did she do that? All out of words again, huh? How convenient. No, I want an answer. Wait here. 
Okay, now write down why she gave you those words. Let me see that. You better have a good answer. You don't know? So what? She was just being nice? Well, if I find out that you're lying, you know what happens. Hey, I'm back. So you like the food? Good, good. Babe, can you hear me? Yeah, she's out. Sorry, but I had a feeling you were going to try and leave tonight. What the hell are you doing? You didn't actually eat the dinner, did you? Well, aren't you quite the little actress, pretending to be asleep like that? Now, what were you doing with my Amber Alert? Missing girl from 2018 shit. So why didn't you call the police right away? I was too scared to call the police at the time, but after they left, I did, and that's when they told me her description matched Claire Montgomery, who's the girl who went missing in 2018. After all I've done for you, and you go and lie to me, I need to ask you a question, and I don't want to set you free, so... How did you? Haven't you figured it out by now? I found a way to steal your words, and I can control how many you get. I mean, I gotta admit, it's pretty adorable watching you anxiously wait every year, hoping you'll get more words. But how many do you always end up getting? Three. And what do I ask you to tell me every year? I love you. I love you. Those were the only words I wanted to hear from you for so long. But you were never into me. Because you were a stalker. I admired you, Claire. I... I care about you a lot. Then let me go. You know I can't do that. I have to protect you. You're insane. And you're using up all your words. Here, take some more. You are a sick son of a... On second thought, maybe it's best if you remain silent. This is why I could never give you any more words. I'll come back down here once you... Looks like we got company. Officer, I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. That may be the case, but we're going to take a look around, and if we don't find anything, then you'll be good to go. So far, I don't see anybody here, sir. Keep looking. Want to get your words back? 10, 10 9, 9, 8, 8 4, 4, 3, 3 2, 2, 1. 1. Words retrieved. Since we can't find anyone, we're going to... No. No help, I'm down here. Wait, where's that coming from? He has a basement. I'm I'm in the basement. Show us where she is right now. Whoa, okay, okay. Hey, are you Claire Montgomery? Yes, yes, that's me. Oh my god. Okay, don't worry, everything's gonna be okay. How did you get your words back? Boys, get him out of here. Don't even look at him, it's alright. Claire, tell him you love me. Tell him that I was good to you. Tell him or else I'll stop it. Somebody get him in the car. Want to take Derek's words? Babe, please! Get in the car, Miss the Paca. Babe, you have to listen to- Don't call me babe. In fact, you're not going to be able to call me anything now. You're finally going to get to feel how I felt for these past three years. Being silenced isn't very fun, is it, Derek? Looks like Miss the Paca got what he deserved. Pet sit a millionaire's dog or tutor a billionaire's child. I'm pretty sure the billionaires are going to pay more. We will pay you 500 Per day? <laughs> Don't be silly, dear. Per hour. Well, that sounds terrific. Where is my son? One moment, I'll go get him. I will be right here. You're going to wish you didn't accept that job. What, is he a lot of trouble or something? You have no idea. Hello, I'm Ronald. Well, it's nice to meet you, Ronald. I'm Bree. You are really tall for 12. Yeah, can we start the tutoring now? We can start right now. Where's a good room to start? This way. Follow me. Hey, Ronald, how are you doing on that worksheet I gave you? I'm done. Here. Oh, that was really fast. <laughs> Is something wrong? It's just that your mom said you were really bad at math, but these all look correct. Where is your mom? On a trip. She just left. Mommy will be gone for a while. Oh, okay, well, I kind of wish they would have mentioned that. I guess we'll just try something a little more challenging for you next time. Would you like a drink? Actually, yeah, that would be great. Thanks. <coughs> Hello? I'm back. Sorry, you scared me. Um, do you know why there's noises coming from that hallway down there? Uh, that's my dog. I'm sorry. He's really loud. Oh, your dog. Okay. <laughs> Here's your drink. I'm actually good. I have to go catch my Uber, but I'll see you tomorrow. Text from the mom. Forgot to mention that Ronald is highly allergic to... dogs. Can we start our lesson? Not yet. 
Ronald, why did you lie to me? I don't know what you're talking about. Yesterday, that noise I heard, you told me it was a dog. Because it is. Ronald, stop. Your mom already texted me telling me you were highly allergic to dogs. So how could you have one? Because I found it on the street and I didn't tell mommy. I'll take special meds just to be around the dog, please. She's the only friend I got. Look, I get it, but Ronald, it's not safe for you or the dog. It's not fair to keep it down there in the basement. Why don't you and I go down there together? We can take it to the rescue shelter and find it a really good home. No, don't go down there. I just, uh, don't want you to get bit by her, because she's only used to me. Don't tell Mommy and Daddy. I promise I'll get her to the shelter. For the problem you're on right now, you're going to need to solve for an X and a Y. X equals 25 and Y equals 6. How did you- Do you have a boyfriend? <laughs> what? I said, do you have a boyfriend? Let's just focus on our work. Sorry. I was just trying to make conversation. Well, I do, but we're kind of long distance and I'm not really sure how long things are gonna- You know what? I really don't want to talk about this right now. Let's just focus on your assignment. <sighs> but I'm starving. And I had the butler make us a special meal. Can we take a lunch break? Okay. Cool. BRB. Gosh, that poor dog. I have to go check on it. Hey, it's okay, girl. I'm gonna open the door. Please don't bite me. <gasps> what did I just see? That didn't look like a dog, that looked Excuse like- Excuse me, miss. Ronald has prepared food for you. But he said that you prepared the meal. No, he insisted on making it himself. Goodbye. Wait, have you ever seen what's behind that door? I have seen many things. I warned you this job wouldn't be worth the money. Wait, where are you going? Oh, Tuta, where'd you go? There you are. Why are you packing up? I'm so sorry, Ronald, but I... I have to go. What? But your meal is already ready. I'm not really hungry anymore. My mommy already paid you for the session. Why are you leaving early? Did you go into the basement? I really need to go. Come on, open. Hello. You know, you really shouldn't have went down there. What is in the basement? Well, you see, you're not really my first tutor. The other ones, they just didn't listen. What is in there? My other tutors. And now you're gonna have to join them. Ugh, my head. She woke up. Shh, you're gonna scare her. What the hell? Where am I? We're all locked in a basement. Wait a minute, are you Ronald's other tutors? Yeah. How long have you guys been down here? We've been down here for like a month. You have? Good, you're awake. So, how are you? Not great. You know, because you hit me in the back of the head with a frying pan. I'm sorry, I just wanted some friends. Ronald, this isn't the way though. You have to let us go. Darling, I'm home. Not a word. Stay quiet. Ronald! Coming, mommy. Ronald, there you Don't are. Don't bother calling for help. She can't hear us. How does a 12-year-old get his hands on something like that? Well, they are billionaires. They probably buy him whatever he wants. Well, there has to be some way out of here. I wish, girl, we tried. Oh my gosh, he left my phone. Can either of you reach it? No, both of our hands are tied. Okay, well, I'm just gonna kick the table over. Ah. Oh my gosh. Okay, who are you calling? I'm using my foot to text my boyfriend. Your boyfriend? No, girl, call the cops. <sighs> no, 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 girls, trust me, this is the right move. He can track my phone and have a team here in just a few minutes. Huh? huh? Is your boyfriend a spy or something? Uh-oh. What? What? My phone died. No. Girls, I'm sorry to do this, but I'll have to get rid of two of you. What? No, please. Ronald, no. Chill, I'm not gonna get rid of- Freeze, kid. What the- Got your text, babe. I had no idea my son was capable of doing such terrible things. Girls, please take this. These checks are for a million. I know. Are you sure? Yes. It's the least I can do. Thank you for saving us, sir. Absolutely. Glad you guys are safe. Girl, he's a real keeper. Yeah, he is. I was meant to be your boyfriend, not him. Can someone please get Ronald McDonald out of here? How dare you! Want to see your boyfriend's feelings? 100%? Guess he's a keeper. Got this for you. Thanks. Of course, babe. Derek, is that you? Olivia. You two know each other? Yeah, we used to... Date! We were together for a little bit. We should all go out sometime. Yeah, we should. Boyfriend lost a little feelings. Hey, babe, do you maybe want to hang out tonight? Oh, sorry, babe. I already invited the boys over. They'll be here in a little bit. It's game night. More feelings lost. What is going on? You know what? Forget it. I don't care if it's boys' night. I have to go talk to him. 
Derek, I... Oh! Holy shit! Is she wearing my... Um, we we can explain. You should have knocked. Oh! Want to get revenge on your boyfriend? Pick your revenge for boyfriend. Revenge is ready. Take your revenge. Remember to use it wisely. Hey, can we talk? There is nothing to talk about. You and I are over. No, don't say that, okay? I just found out that Olivia is with another guy. Well, you know what they say. Karma is a real... Maria, please. What I did was stupid, and I promise it's not going to happen again. I want you, not her. Thanks for giving me a second chance. Of course. I'm not one to hold a grudge. You look so beautiful, babe. Thanks. Babe, I gotta tell you, this food is, like, really good. I'm glad you like it. I made it myself. What? I didn't know you could cook. You even got my favorite drink. Should we make a toast? To us. To us. Oh, babe, I hope you don't mind I switched our drinks. The one you gave me smelt a little strong. Whoa! You switched them? Yeah, I didn't think it was that big of a deal. <laughs> You've been coughing a lot. Are you okay? You know what? I'm gonna go get you some water. Your revenge has backfired. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Would you like to receive the antidote? Is that even a question? Yes. Sorry I took so long, babe. Here you go. Thanks. What a hero. Boyfriend has lost a little feelings. That boy gains and loses feelings for me every five seconds. Olivia, what the hell are you doing here? It's Derek. He's in the hospital. Haven't you checked your phone? He got into a car accident. Derek? Bria, you came. Oh, I'm so glad I'll have you to take care of me. Actually, no, you won't. Because I'm breaking up with you. What? No! Please. It's like I said, Derek. Karma. It's a real bit. So, how many words you get for the year? Only three again. Aw, oh, might as well use them up. Come on. I love you. And I love you more. Hi, huh, what can I get you today? She doesn't have any words, miss, but I'll order for her. She's just gonna have a salad, but I'm gonna get a cheeseburger, double fries. Babe, you're looking kind of pale today. You wanna get your makeup done? Yeah, you do. Come on, let's go. I love this color on you. Me too. Hey, babe, show her the bruise. Any chance you can cover that? She's so clumsy. Oh, yeah, totally. We can take care of that. Sir, would you want to buy the concealer I use on her? Actually, yeah, that'd be great. I'll go pay for this. You stay here. I love this. He can't hear us anymore. Here, take some words. Please, you can trust me. Is something wrong? He can't hear you right now. He's not my boyfriend. He's not, is he? I knew it. Okay, listen, I'm going to get help for you. But I'm gonna need you to give me some more information. He's coming. Okay, got the concealer. Time to go. Sir, wait. He's not my boyfriend. He's not, is he? I knew it. Okay, listen, I'm going to get help for you. But I'm gonna need you to give me some more information. He's coming. Okay, got the concealer. Time to go. Sir, wait. Why is the makeup lady chasing after us? Sir! Let's get out of here. Well, that was weird. Did she at least cover up your bruise? Good. Good. Go change your hair to a different style. I'm gonna go make dinner. You look much better now, babe. Breaking news as of today. What's going on? Let me turn this up. No, don't! Did you just... How the hell did you get words? So now you want to be quiet, huh? Answer me! How did you get them? You don't have any left now, do you? Give me that remote. You better hope this news isn't about you. So this girl comes into my makeup store with a bruise. I gave her some words and it turns out the man she was with... <laughs> you ratted me out? After everything that I've done for you, I have been so good to you. Now that's gonna change. Police, open the door. They finally found me, but they won't find you. Officer, I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. I'm the only one who lives here. Yeah, well, I've searched the whole place. I haven't seen anything. Right, the missing girl's obviously not here. It seems so, but you match the description of the kidnapper. There's definitely been a mistake. Down here, I'm down here. What was that? Wait a minute, don't- Oh my god. You found me. Ma'am, stay right there. Mr. Hart, you're under arrest. Thank you so much for finding me. He's had me here for two years. He's been controlling your words. What? Yes, ma'am. We found this illegal device on him that steals people's words. 
That would explain why every year I would only get three words. Go on, say it. I love you. And he made me say I loved him. Hey, come here! Ugh. You don't deserve to sp- Ugh. Get back here! The only one that doesn't deserve to speak is you. That's right, and she's keeping your words permanently. Now you finally see what it feels like to not have a voice. It doesn't feel good, does it? Prison's gonna be real fun for him. Ugh. You're finally free now. Alright, Mr. Hart, let's go. Any last words before you go off to prison? <sighs> oh wait, you don't have any. <laughs> Anything I touch turns to money, or any doll I touch comes to life. I'm too little to have money, and I don't have any friends in foster care, so I pick this one. I pick this Barbie to come to life. Whoa. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. Are you going to be my friend? Of course, I can be anything you want me to be. You can brush my hair and take me anywhere. Cool. You can also customize me using this remote. I want to give you brown eyes like me. Oh, Claire, who are you talking to? Uh-oh, who's that? That's another foster girl that lives here, and she's really mean to dolls. We have to hide you. Come on. Claire, who are you talking to? Nobody. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. What the... Barbie, I told you to hide. Sorry, Claire. I just love making new friends. Does this control her? Hey, give that back. Ugh, just let me see it. Stop! You're gonna break her! Ugh, you're so annoying. This is why no one wants to adopt you. I don't want your dumb remote anyways. You killed her! <laughs> Have fun with your dead Barbie. Barbie, please wake up. Hola! Soy Barbie. ¿Cómo estás? Uh-oh, I think she reset you onto Spanish mode. Eres mi mejor amiga. Barbie, I can't understand you. What am I gonna do? Barbie, I can use my powers to bring Ken to life to help us. I hope you know how to bring Barbie off of Spanish mode. Hey, Barbie. Hola, Ken. Why is she speaking Spanish? That's why I brought you here, Ken. I don't know how to make her speak English. Can I see her remote? Sure. That should do it. Hey, Barbie. Hi, Ken. Want to go for a drive? Sure, Ken. Activate the Barbie car. We cannot tell anyone that you're dolls. What do we say if they ask us? Tell them that, that you're my parents. Okay. Shh, we have to be really quiet so we can sneak out of here. Thanks for buying me this stuff, Barbie. Claire, you deserve it. Hey, you. You never paid me back my money. Claire. Claire. How dare you? Who are you guys? We are her parents. She got adopted. That's right, and one of her mother's many jobs is being a police officer. So if you don't leave right now, we're going to have you arrested. No, no, sorry, forget about the money. Bye! Claire! Are you okay? My arm got a little cut. Press the top button on the remote. Okay. Dr. Barbie is here to help. You're so strong, Claire. You should be feeling much better now. Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well... I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Claire, we... I understand if you don't want to because I know I'm not that great. What? Why would you think that? Because I'm not as smart or as cute as the other kids. I think that's why nobody wants to adopt me. Oh, Claire. Don't think like that. You're so smart. And you're super cute. Do you really think so? Claire, you can do anything you put your mind to. And anyone who tells you otherwise doesn't know what they're talking about. We would be honored to be your parents because you're such a good girl. Right, Ken? That's right, Barbie. Really? Yeah. Being a dad sounds fun. Guys, I forgot I had this in my pocket. My puppy. Since we're a family now, do we want to have a pet? Absolutely. Aww. Aww. This is going to be so much fun. I'll start looking for Barbie houses for us to live in. I'm so happy for us. We're going to be a great family. Yeah, Barbie and Ken finally together at last. Ugh. Ow, my head. Barbie, Ken, what's wrong? Ugh, my head. Barbie, Ken, what's wrong? I... I don't know. All of a sudden, we just feel really strange. My powers, they're running out. Oh no. All of you are gonna turn back into dolls. How much time do we have left? One minute. 
Please don't leave me. Claire, we'll never leave you. We might not be able to be your parents, but we'll always be your dolls. Yes, and you're going to get adopted. Do you promise? We promise. I'm going to miss you so much. We'll still be together. You can take us wherever you go. Barbie, our eyes. They're melting. You guys are crying. Oh, the time's up. You guys are going to... We love you. See you on the other side. If it isn't the little tattletale, where are your parents now, huh? They're right... They're at home. So you better not try anything or I'm going to tell on you. No, no, I was just wondering. <laughs> I was looking for you all day. I'm sorry, I was just... I didn't want to hear it. You're lucky someone wants to adopt you. What? I'm getting adopted? Yes, finally. You guys were right. What? Who was right? Nothing. Meet your new parents. Hi. Hey. Can I bring my dolls? Oh, honey, of course. We'll consider them a part of our family. Okay, pick a babysitter. A Navy SEAL or a ninja? What kind of options are those? I need someone who can protect you while I'm away. From what? An army? You know, ever since Dad died, you've been acting really weird. Sissy, pick the SEAL. You do realize it's not the animal SEAL? You know what? Never mind. Thanks for coming. These are my kids Sarah, Sadie, and the baby Susie. Nice to meet you. Miss Lane, I can assure you, your kids are in great hands. I want dinner. Shut up! She's asleep. I don't care. I'm hungry. Don't make me push you into the wall. Hey, don't talk to your sister like that. And you kid need to learn some manners. Her learn manners, please. You also do realize you're not the first babysitter we had. Is that so? Yeah, you're like the fifth one. All the other ones quit. Uh-huh. They don't like us. Said we're not disciplined enough. Well, I can assure you I'm not going to quit. It's my duty to protect you. <laughs> well, speaking of duty, I'll let you handle that. Uh, wait! Just, um, FYI, you're putting on her diaper backwards. It's supposed to go this. Somebody's in the house. Take the baby and stay here. Sadie! Shh, stay very quiet. Somebody's in the house. Take the baby and stay here. Sadie! Shh, stay very quiet. <laughs> Gosh, it's gonna be okay. Sarah! Are you okay? No, there was a scary guy outside my window. What? Your security has been compromised. What is going on? <sighs> Listen, there's a reason your mother hired me to watch over you guys. I'll explain. So let me get this straight. Our dad was a spy, and now the bad guys that were after him are after us? Yes. They're after a stolen laptop your dad had retrieved before he died. Somebody tried to break in today, but I'm gonna protect you guys, I promise. You guys need to wear these. What does this do? It's a tracking bracelet. Will this help keep us safe? Yes, it's so I can keep track of you. Is this yours? I found it in Dad's office. Sadie, you know you're not supposed to be down there, and this isn't mine. Wait a minute, didn't Neff the babysitter say that the bad guys were after a stolen laptop? Do you hear that sound? Yeah, I hear it. Hello, girls. Do you hear that beeping sound? Yeah, I hear it. Hello, girls. Don't be scared. Just give me the laptop. No. Maybe this will change your mind. Mm -hmm. Susie! You let her go! <laughs> let go of her! Sadie! Come here! <laughs> give me the laptop now. Okay, okay, just take it. Finally! You have what you want, now let them go! I don't think so. Take them to the other room. No! Sadie, are you okay? <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, the babysitter, he's gonna save us. Do you mean this babysitter? Neff! Ugh. No one can save you now. Sadie, I think I can get free, but I need you to make the baby cry. Okay. <laughs> Why is she crying? She hates that sound. Hey, you! Is that a charger? <laughs> what are you gonna do with that, huh? Well, let's try this. Oh, my eye! I'm scared. It's gonna be alright, let's get you free. Neff, come on, wake up! <gasps> what what happened? The bad guys, they got the laptop and... What is going on? Girls, stay back. You think you can fight? <gasps> You're not gonna bother them ever again. Go Neff, go Neff! Kick his ass! Where did you learn how to say that? <laughs> I don't know. Thank you for protecting my girls. Of course, Miss Lane. Those men shouldn't be bothering them anymore. Wait, Neff, you're not leaving us now, are you? 
Can you please just stay a little bit longer? Girls. Please. As long as it's okay with your mother. I guess it would be nice to have a man around the house. All right, it's fine with me. Yay. Let's see what sense you lose, honey. Touch? Oh, wow. Does that mean that I can't feel pain? Yep, it sure does. Oh, this is going to be the best day ever. And then after that, I got so embarrassed that I... Whoops. You jerk, you hit her right in the head. Hey, it's okay. I, I can't feel pain. Oh. Really? Well, in that case, will you go to the blood drive with me? I'm really scared to go alone. Um, okay. Okay, let me see your arm. Does that hurt? Actually, I don't feel pain today. Oh, well, in that case, would you mind if we take a little bit extra blood? Yeah, sure. Go right ahead. Um, honey, wake up. You're all done. I got a little bit distracted, but you should be fine. Mom, I'm feeling kind of lightheaded. Oh, dear. Okay, honey, I'm taking you to get checked out. Any discomfort here? And how many fingers now? Three. I got your lab results, and I don't know how you didn't feel this. I can't believe you didn't feel this. Feel what? You said you've been feeling kind of lightheaded, correct? Yeah, just like kind of dizzy. That's because you have lost a significant amount of blood. Did you go to a blood drive or anything recently? Does that hurt? Actually, I don't feel pain today. Oh, well, in that case, would you mind if we take a little bit extra blood? Yeah, sure. Go right ahead. That lady, she did this to me. What lady, honey? The one from the blood drive. I have to go find her. Oh, no, you don't. You are in no condition to leave. But, honey, listen to the doctor. How are you not feeling pain? You almost died. Your heart could have stopped. Oh, my. You might want to close your eyes for this part. Is that a bite mark? That nurse at the blood drive, she must have been a... 